I'm Nathan Judah, I'm here with Steve Maley, and, and Steve, some interesting developments in the transfer market. Yeah, uh, two names that we already knew about, um, David Marshall, uh, goalkeeper from, from Cardiff, and Johnny Evans, uh, central defender from, uh, from Manchester United. West Brom have made a little bit of progress over the weekend on those, and they hope to make some more progress in the early part of, the, of this week, in the hope of, uh, of maybe getting those two signed up uh, in time for the Stoke game at, at the weekend, obviously with the transfer window. Uh, running, running down. Also, interestingly, uh, I've, I've been told that that doesn't necessarily, even if they get Johnny Evans, I mean that the Federico, Federico Fazio deal from Tottenham is, is necessarily dead. Uh, they, that they may look to, to sign both, which would be a, a big change at centre back. But Tony Pulis clearly wasn't happy with some of the goals they conceded against Chelsea uh, on, on Sunday. So, uh, so yeah, we, we could see two, but Evans is the one who se seems to be closer at the moment. And maybe one who might go out, Julian Lescott was on the bench against Chelsea, do you, feel, do you feel he could be the one to, to move on? Yeah, I think if, if Evans comes in then Lescott is the, is the most likely one to go. And if they were to get, to get Fazio as well then that would obviously raise more question marks over Jonas Olsen who's only got a year left on his contract. So yeah, I would, I would say Lescott again is the more likely one to go but potentially both of them if Albion bring in two reinforcements. Yeah, that's going to be a busy next few days. Make sure you log on to all the transfer latest exclusively at expressandstar.com.